rainbows, uh, maybe a few brookies and cutthroat that get washed out of the other streams. Zeke Hirsch depends upon the Colorado River for his living as the owner of Blue River Anglers in Frisco, Colorado. Just the health of a tourist you know, town, if you don't have the water, everything dries up, um, it's gonna hurt, it's gonna hurt big time. Outdoor recreation supports more than 100,000 jobs in Colorado, and many others in the West rely on the Colorado River. 30 million for drinking water, and also for farming and industry. But the Colorado's water levels have dropped 35% in the past 10 years, and that shows dramatically downstream. Out here in the actual river plain, it's definitely uh, devastating, you know, to see that. Hirsch is part of a coalition called Protect the Flows, Hundreds of large and small businesses in the Colorado and its tributaries. Some members followed the river to Mexico to see what they hope is not their future. The Department of Interior is now conducting a study on ways to balance the use of the river's water for the next 50 years. Zeke Hirsch and other business leaders say it's important for them and everyone in the basin to get it right. In my business, we want the water to be used efficiently anyways. With the way technology's going, I think everybody can use water smarter. Protecting the Colorado's flows, a message they'll share back home and in Washington. I'm Bruce Burkhardt.